For the past few years, I've been mostly content with the progress I've made getting back on my feet again. But after being hit by a car last year and breaking my leg, I'm pretty much back to square one. Recently, I discovered the C-Brace by Autobach and its potential to get me back on my feet again blew me away. So today, I'm gonna demonstrate all the ways I think the C-Brace can help me replace my wheelchair and my crutches. A lot of people think the reason I choose my wheelchair over my crutches is because I'm a big sissy who just can't handle any pain. And that's kind of true. I really don't like being in pain. But the bigger issue is actually the knee joint on the left leg. The hyperextension over time can deteriorate the joint to the point of it breaking and snapping in half and then I'll have to get an entire knee replacement surgery and I want to preserve that as much as I possibly can. So other than pain management, I'm really just trying to not have to have another surgery and get this whole knee replaced. Without the C-brace, going upstairs can be really tedious and really slow. I've got to carry my crutch with me and I can only also go one step at a time. With the C-brace, hopefully I won't need a crutch and I'll be able to actually go up multiple stairs at a time, like so, instead of this very weird way that I'm doing it right now. Going downstairs, I find myself in a similar position. I'm gonna have to carry my crutch with me and just go one step at a time. However, there are some other ways that I've found going downstairs easier, but I would not recommend doing this unless you are 100% sure of your ability to balance and your strength, because I hate waiting. So there are really only two ways to get down any kind of grassy hill. Uh, that is going sideways and being very slow and very patient with your crutches. Uh, but in my situation, I always like to take the bunny hop approach. Usually downhill, anything is way easier than uphill. Whew. Ta da! Now going uphill is a little bit different because there's not really a bunny hop option. Uh, this is one of the things that I saw on Autobox website is the ability to go up and down uh, inclines and declines without the need of assistive devices. I even saw a girl go uh, hiking which that was pretty cool. But pretty much you just have to go strong leg first and be really technically skilled with your crutches and make sure you don't roll your ankles or anything dumb like that. But you know, these are the reasons why I choose whoo, <laughs> the wheelchair most of the time because these kind of things are just not really realistic. So I think this one uh, really goes without much explanation why the C-brace would be an advantage to use uh, going through doors, uh, simply because my hands would be free to open them and I'd have a nice sturdy brace to pull them open. So if the two big reasons why I don't walk is pain management and longevity, then hopefully the C-Brace can help me with that. As you guys have seen, you know, the technology that's available through the C-Brace is the robotic knee joint that uh, prevents any kind of hyperextension and kind of aids in the assistance of my gait and walking. Also keeps the ankle from rolling over. Um, after the C-Brace gets fitted, I'm excited to see what happens. I'm also excited to see what happens with this other leg. Um, it's mostly good, um, except for the ankle is super unstable and I'd probably have to get some type of uh, orthotic to get that taken care of as well. But the ability to go hiking without my wheelchair would be incredible. The ability to ride a bike, the ability to go for walks, you know, to have stairs. I mean, the Autobach C-Brace is not an exoskeleton. It doesn't move for you. It doesn't walk for you. You actually still have to use your legs. And over time, that leg strength can grow and grow and grow and potentially maybe even to the point where the brace isn't even needed at all. And th wouldn't that be insane? Wouldn't that just be crazy? Gosh, I mean, I know this channel is called Wheels to Walking, but like, I didn't actually think I'd be going this far with it. And, and never did I ever think that something like getting hit by a car would be a good thing. You know, because if it wasn't for being hit by the car and breaking my leg, I don't think I would have ever taken the time to even listen to anyone or even talk to anyone or investigate or go to an appointment about getting any kind of brace because I've used braces before and they were crap and I hated them. And, you know, I'd used crutches and they're, they're super obnoxious. And, you know, just being in the chair for me makes a lot of sense. But the fact that this technology is available is really exciting to me. And I really hope that, um, 
like I get it and it works uh, but both I mean I hopefully I can afford it too I mean there's so many things and you know maybe even this video can get the attention of people at Autobach and if it does hi reach out to me I'd love to find a way to professionally collaborate I think that would be an awesome way for you to reach more people and for me to be able to get some independence and freedom back in my life be sure to like this video if you enjoyed it and be sure to subscribe thanks for watching we'll see you in the next one